Sakafets YouTube and welcome back to my channel. Let us make the most amazing curry lobster. darlings it's so nice to have you back here in my kitchen i've got two lobster tails and i'm gonna go ahead and cut it into small pieces i'm gonna go ahead and wash it with some lemon juice and cool water and then we're gonna season it up Once it's all cleaned, I drained it off and then I'm just going to transfer it into a clean bowl. I'm also going to squeeze the juice of half a lemon on the lobster and this is going to keep it nice and fresh. Cut back on any fresh seafood smell that it will have. And yes, my darlings, I will be leaving all of the ingredients down below in the description box. So make sure you check it out for whatever it is that I use. So just as I was about to season, baby started fussing, but hey, the show must go on. So I started off by adding a little seasoning cube. I went in with some curry powder. I'm also going to go in with some turmeric powder as well. Don't forget your black pepper, garlic powder. Like I said, everything I use will be down below in the description box. Once all my seasonings have been added to the bowl, I'm going to go ahead and give it a really good mix. And then my son had to come and take baby because I don't want to cook with him on me. Seasoning is all right. I don't really want to light the stove or anything like that with him on me so yes here i'm just adding in some of that freshly chopped seasonings that i had from a couple days ago and some better pack curry powder for that nice rich curry color and yes darlings this is literally it it's gonna be time to mix and curry this up
Once my lobster was nicely seasoned, in a clean pot I went in with some butter, about 2 to 3 tablespoons of butter. I added in my seasoned lobster and I added in one bay leaf to the pot. Let it steam on low heat, don't add any liquid or anything like that, just let it steam on low heat for about 10 minutes covered. After 10 minutes, it's gonna be cooked, you don't need to add no liquids, no nothing in this, it's already looking amazing. Whilst my lobster was cooking, I'm gonna be frying some plantains. So I thought why not just show you how I slice it up and everything. I'm also steaming some basmati rice on the side. And this is how I will be enjoying my lobster today. So some gorgeous curry lobster with some fried plantains. A little steam rice, you know, something really quick, literally comes together within half an hour and you have dinner sorted. Well, after about 10 minutes, this is how the lobster was looking. Imagine I didn't add any liquid to this and look at how much juices is released. And this is how it came out. I garnished with some fresh parsley and it was just so, so beautiful. Look at the little sauce, just some gorgeous sauce, nothing too much, just a light little sauce, something really yummy. So I'm gonna go ahead and serve this up, everything is ready and as you can see here I got my lobster, I got my fried plantain, I got my white rice. Let's plate this up man. This is it nicely plated it looks so yummy so gorgeous and i know some of you might wonder why is it i left the peel on but just for presentation purposes and harry's baby we're trying up something new today first time baby trying up some seafood and he loves his rice so yeah i literally let him try everything that i'm making he's one now so anything i make i tend to give him some i have some myself so we can sort of eat together and yes this is actually my hubby's plate and i'm here pinching off of it here <laughs> yes darlings it's been such a pleasure having you here in my kitchen i can't wait to see you in the next one thank you for watching bye bye